you want to just tag like compass and string? Huh? Person? Yep, okay. Hi, Tim So as you can see, I kind of tagged myself, got tagged, whatever, to do the 100 questions don't ever ask tag. So I'm gonna do that. These are the 100 questions no one ever asked. I hope you learned something about me. Wee! Question time. Do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? Closed! Do you take the shampoo and conditioner bottles from hotels? Nope. Although my mum and my brother do and we have a jar this big full of them. Do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out? I normally just have a doona. That thing. Although I have this sheet when it's hot. And both are always tucked out. Have you ever stolen a street sign before? Nope. Do you like to use post-it notes? Nope. Do you cut coupons out and then never use them? I don't cut coupons. So, nope. Lots of notes. This has been interesting. Would you rather be attacked by a big bear or swarm of bees? Swarm of bees. Regarding I'm not allergic. I'm pretty sure I'm not, but I've never been stung. So I don't know, but let's just go with bees. Because they're small and they're not going to like maul my face off. Like, <laughs> Do I have freckles? Yes. Did you see them? I don't know if you can see them. And I've got face stuff on, but I have freckles. It's just around here. Do you always smile for pictures? <laughs> no. So many pictures of people are all nice and I'm like, oh. Okay, that's a smile, but it's like a creepy smile. You know, something like that. I like to make stupid faces. I'll be like, what is my biggest pet peeve? Pet peeve is when people do those things on Facebook. Inbox me, you know, inbox them yourself. You know what you gotta do? You gotta go up, press the messages button, click new message, type in the name, <gasps> inbox. If you want to talk to someone, you can inbox them. Or like, inbox me. No, inbox me. Just one of you do it. Seriously. If you want someone to inbox you, just inbox them. Like, you know how much time you're wasting? Like, oh, let's inbox. Okay, who'll send the first one? You, me, you. it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Just someone, open, say it. <coughs> That's my biggest pet peeve. Don't even, I could rant about that forever. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Anyway, next question. Do you ever count your steps when you walk? No. Maybe. No. Have you ever peed in the woods? No. What about pooped in the woods? No. Do you dance even if there's no music playing? What were we talking about? Do you chew your pens and pencils? Yes. Not pencils, just pens. How many people have you slept with this week? Well, let me get my list. Oh, look at that, no one. What size is your bed? Queen. Funny fact, when I first got it, I was so not used to a big bed that I curled up in the corner at the very top and now I'm like, Pfft. this is my territory. Yeah. What is your song of the week? Are you satisfied by Maroon and Diamonds? Is it okay for guys to wear pink? Yeah, why not? Just don't be like Ross and call it salmon and just deny it's pink because that's not cool. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there's a door. Do you still watch cartoons? No, I don't watch much at all. And what is your least favorite movie? Beaches. Don't ever watch Beaches. Where would you bury hidden treasure if you found some? I would sell it for the monies. And if I'm gonna hide it, I wouldn't tell you guys because it's my treasure. Hey, what do you drink with dinner? Diet Coke. What do you dip a chicken nugget in? Tomato sauce. What is your favorite food? Chocolate. What movies could you watch over and over and still love? Mean Girls. Perks Being a Wallflower. Cry Baby. What's eating Gilbert Grape? And anything with Johnny Depp, basically. Last person you kissed slash kissed you. Did that kiss me on the cheek when you got home from work? Did we ever a boy slash girl scout? No, I wasn't a girl scout. Clearly a boy scout. I'm kidding. I've been no type of scout. I am scoutless. Would you ever strip or pose nude in a magazine? No. Naked is for the shower. When was the last time you wrote a letter on paper to someone? Maybe five, six years ago. Can you change the oil in your car? If you give me a car which I can keep, sure. I'm 15. I don't have a car. I don't need to oil change. So no. Ever gotten a speeding ticket? What did I just say? I don't drive, so no. Ever run out of gas? Right, for the last time, I don't have a car. I don't drive. Favorite kind of sandwich? Fairy bread. And by the last kind of sandwich, well, if you get one piece of fairy bread, another piece of fairy bread, sandwich. Best thing to eat for breakfast time? Piece of toast, margarine, put it on, and then it melts and you have happiness. What is your usual bedtime? Maybe 10.30ish to 11? Are you lazy? <laughs> I'm like the biggest athlete out there. I mean, really, I'm just getting into that exercise. You know, running every day and, and doing the, the jumps and... Just kidding, I'm the laziest person you'll ever meet. I am extremely lazy. <laughs> Not afraid to admit it. When you were a kid, what did you dress up as for Halloween? Halloween isn't really a big thing in Australia. Um, so only once I dressed up 
I was like a witch, except my hat had two points. It looked like a Madonna bra. There I am. Look at me. I was some kind of witch cape type thing. I'm not entirely sure. I think I was a witch. What is your Chinese astrological sign? An ox. O. X. Ox. Look, I could be in the spelling bee. How many languages can you speak? Indonesian primary school, German in high school. So I can speak a little, 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 little bit. And English. So one and a bit. That's my answer. Do you have any magazine subscriptions? No. What is better, Lego or Lincoln Legs? Lego! Hada. That's not even a question. Are you stubborn? I can be. Who is better, Lino or Letterman? I've never watched them, but Letterman is like a cool name, like Lino, man. Letterman! The man of letters. Ever watch a soap opera? No, I've never watched a soap opera. Are you afraid of heights? No. Do you sing in the car? Yeah. All the time. I was singing on the way home from school today with the window open. Singing my lungs out. Mm -hmm. Do you sing in the shower? No. Do you dance in the car? No. Ever use the gun? No. Unless you count on Xbox. And last time you got a portrait taken by a photographer? School photos! About a month or two ago. Do you think musicals are cheesy? No. They don't seem to be any type of dairy product. Is Christmas stressful? No. Ever eaten a pero... Hang on. Pyrogi. 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 I don't eat food with funny names. Favorite kind of pie. I don't have a favorite. I don't like pie. I think I've had pie. I, I don't know if I've had pie. Occupation you wanted to be when you were a kid. I wanted to be a singer. I wanted to do a duet with Elder Goodrum. It was going to be great. And do you believe in ghosts? Let's not even go into what I believe in. That's just. Have you ever had a deja vu feeling? Yes, I have. I take vitamins daily. No, don't take vitamins. You wear slippers. These ratty things are my slippers, but they're so comfy. So I don't really care that they're old and grey. I wear a bathrobe. We call it a dressing gown and that's it right there. So yes, I wear one. What do you wear to bed? I generally wear a really big t-shirt and then comfy, loose, soft pants or loose, soft shorts. First concert, the Hooli Doolies. Okay, that doesn't really count. And I could say this day on the green concert I went to when I was like 9 or 10, but I don't count that because it was actually a music festival and I didn't listen or watch any performance. I ran around the sprinklers and ran away screaming from women who decided it would be fun to take off their shirts and wave them around. So I don't count that because I wasn't even in the concert area. They had food and stuff out the back and I was like out in that area running around. So I count my first concert as the Paramore one I went to, which was 13 of October 2010. Just because Hooli Dooley is more like a performance, I think. I don't remember. Apparently I got scared. And it was a music festival, so technically not a concert. Although you may say technically it is. But shh. Or Walmart, Target, or Kmart. Kmart, Nike, or Adidas. I don't sport Cheetos or Fritos. I don't know what a Frito is, and I don't like Cheetos. None. And peanut or sunflower seeds. Neither. Don't like either. Nope. Ever heard of the group Tresbin? No. Ever taken dance lessons? No. Is there a profession you see your future spouse doing? I don't, I don't really care. It's like I'm gonna go, I want a professional banana. But I'll say, we're like a banana, that would be cool. Oh, that's, this is getting into weird territory. Can you kill your tongue? Yeah. Ever want a spelling bee? No. You ever cried because you were so happy? Yes, I cried when I got my dog. Own any record albums? I own All We Know Is Falling by Paramore. I own a record player? No. To regularly burn incense? No. I'm not trusted with fire. <laughs> Ever been in love? No. Hey, who would you like to see in concert? All right, you guys, you ready for my list? All right, I'd like to see Paramore again, I'd like to see Tonight Live again, but if we're talking fresh, start. Panic at the Disco, The Pretty Reckless, Versa, Emerge, The Killers, Landa, Ray, Marina, and The Diamonds, We Are The Ink Girl. I'm just gonna leave it at that because they came out straight away. What was the last concert you saw? Tonight Live in May last year. Hot or cold tea? Cold, definitely cold. I have never had a full cup of tea because one person made it for me and literally I burnt my mouth five times so I never actually got to drink any of it and enjoy it so cold tea tea or coffee never had coffee and like i just said i've never really been able to have tea because i've burnt my mouth that many times but i'm gonna go with tea so because I, I have had that i just nearly burned my mouth off my face sugar or snickerdoodle i'm actually not a sweet tooth i'm gonna go with snickerdoodles even though I'm, i have no idea what that is it's a funny word so i choose that and that is logic can you swim well I can swim, I don't know about well. I can do backstroke okay, I like to do this one. But freestyle kills me, I can't. Or can you hold your breath without holding your nose? 
that was weird but yes are you patient hell no impatient and stubborn i'm just yelling fabulous is dj or band the wedding i think i'm gonna go with band but ever won the contest no so sad no. You ever had plastic surgery no no plastic surgery al natural and which are better black or green olives neither don't like olives can you knit or crochet no best room for the fireplace the toilet do you want to get married I don't really mind. If married, how long have you been married? No, I'm not married. Who was your high school crush? I'm still in high school, so, um... Do you cry and throw a fit and do it get your own way? No. Do you have kids? No, I don't have any baby goat. Where would I keep a goat? Do you want kids? Sure, why not? What is your favourite colour? Pink? You might be able to tell from the pink walls, but actually... That is a ridiculously bright pink, and I prefer like you know softer pinks. And then white, you might be able to tell from all the white, and also like aquary turquoisey colours. Do you miss anyone right now? Yes, I do. Something that happened to you in middle school. Australia doesn't really have middle school, but my school's in two campuses, so just about the first campus because it was like the middle one because I primary in the middle campus, and yeah, it's going to be a serious answer for the last one. That's why I'm going like this. But seriously, one thing that happened was I somehow managed to do pretty much no math work for ages and somehow I passed. And that is it for this tag. So I hope you like this tag and learned something about me and I hope I didn't bore you for however long this went for, probably like an hour and a half. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you subscribe, comment, like, favourite that stuff that I always tell you to do because you're awesome little ones. I tag all of you guys. This is the tag. That's right. This is the tag. Take it. Take the tag. You know you want it. There you go. You now have the tag. So do it. Seriously, if you do the tag, leave this video response. Thank you all for watching. Hope I didn't bore you all to death. And have a great day or night or whatever it is for you. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Look guys, I actually have eyebrows. I'll show you my life. <laughs> Blame poop, 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 po